Hello everyone! The game mode selection window will receive an update in version 0.23.0. Besides aesthetic upgrades, we'll also add a weekly mode rotation and adjust the categories. Let's take a closer look. The main new feature is related to the PvE and PvP categories. When selecting one of these categories, you will be able to pick several modes in it simultaneously, or even all of them. Picking all modes in a category is useful, as it speeds up queue times considerably and awards you 10% bonus XP for the Operator, Battle Pass, and combat pay after each battle. The point of this change is to unite players who wish to play different modes, improve matchmaking, and consequently, improve the quality of battles. Ranked battles and events will receive their own spots in the selection window. User battles, practice, and training will be placed beside them. Special modes prepared for events like Victory Day or Marathon will be placed in the new eponymous category. While there are no active events, the game modes will be rotated regularly. The rotation will allow you to both enjoy various modifiers, such as Fog of War, and play the old modes that didn't become Caliber mainstays. The event exclusive mode will be available until the event ends. The random rotating mode will be available for three days from Friday, 8 a.m. UTC, to Monday, 8 a.m. UTC. Frontline and Onslaught Legend will be removed from the regular categories. It will still be possible to play them, but only when they come up in the rotation. Frontline mode paved the way for Threshold mode. We consider Threshold to be a promising mode that more and more players are enjoying. Thus, we have decided to put more resources into supporting it. Frontline mode will still sometimes be available on the weekend. Onslaught Legend didn't become quite as popular, but we value the hardcore fans who love it, so we decided to keep it and put it into the rotation. Special Operation will stay, but will be made more difficult. A map with an active Fog of War effect will be chosen randomly for each battle. And finally, a quick arcade version of Hacking Mode will appear in the PvP category. If you like hacking, but are put off by the strict rules of the ranked version, then this mode is for you. All of these changes will improve queue times and matchmaking quality and will allow you to play previously event-exclusive modes every weekend. Check out the article on our official site to learn more. That's about it. See you on the battlefield!